Before we design product, we need to know what we are designing for. Doing research is sort of like designing a house, building a house on a good foundation. So it's a really necessary phase before we actually start drawing. I'm a big believer in research. I really think that you can't bring a product to market without doing your due diligence in terms of researching A, what's out there, and B, what the needs really are in the market. What people tell you is one thing, but when you watch them do it in reality, you learn so much more. And it's one of those things that people probably don't appreciate the, the level of thought that went into that. They just know that it's working for them. And, and at the end of the day, I think there's no greater compliment than when people just love using your product and have a, a really positive experience with it. And that the thought that went into it is almost seems effortless. It's just about keeping up with the industry. It's keep, about keeping up with the times. But it's about keeping up with people. The way I approach problem solving is to first understand the user. And, and being able to tap into that is, is, what, is uh, what I do in terms of research. And how that informs design is also how I'm able to break down that research and data, analyze that, and make that into insights that we can use to design and, and make integrated meaningful solutions. I think it's all about meaning. It's about understanding what products and services and buildings and environments mean to people. And, and I think it's, we are after that, that fundamental meaning that we can change. We can, we can influence people by what something can mean to them.